listening. I'm Elna Land here at the Stevenage Community Trust annual dinner and dance. Tonight, after last year's major success, most of the Trust's members and trustees are gathering here at the Priory Barn to celebrate the success the Trust had this past year. With special guest speaker, English Ocean Rower MBE Ros Savage. I'm already feeling this is such a wonderful life-affirming evening just to hear about the story of the recipients of the grants from uh, the SCT. Um, it just really gave me this wonderful sense of community and well-being. What made you want to get involved with the Trust and their work? Well, it's so important to have a sense of community. Um, even like as a solo ocean rower, I relied on my community to help make that happen. So I just love this idea of people supporting other people. It's very easy to fall in love with it because people here tonight know that virtually every penny they're going to raise is going to go straight back out to a good cause. I mean, so many people in Stevenage need an awful lot of help. And there's an awful lot of people in Stevenage that have a lot to give. And it just needs that little bit of a catalyst to just say, can we just chip a little bit in and help someone else? Just got to get more of the local community involved in this, more of the local businesses involved in this, and just for them to understand and realise how much of a difference it makes locally. Just see it as a, an amazing conduit for us to be able to give something back to the community. At the end of the day, the people that we employ come from our community, and we send a very clear message as employers if we're part of the community trust, if we care about our community, you know we're going to care about them as team members, as our employees. For years we've given out gift vouchers, a £100 gift voucher to a family, which really, really impacted on their Christmas. Um, about three years ago I went to Caroline and said actually this isn't changing, the next year they're in the same position. So we, did, we had a meeting and lots of cups of coffee and a few tears talking about families and in the end we, we decided to link up with the credit union. Caroline ran with that and took that forward and actually every year now they get £100 the first year, the second year if they become savers for the whole year they get their money doubled up to a value of £100 and we are now seeing our lifetime savers. One family, um, she had two, two Christmases in crisis. Last year she saved £300. The one thing that always resonates with everybody here tonight is the 200 neediest families, where all we gift is £100. And when you heard uh, one of the recipients early on this evening sharing the impact that that has, um, it, you, you, you find it hard not to become emotional. Um, so, so therefore it's easy for us to want to continue our work. You actually see the small donations making a big, big, big difference. And being able to see that happening locally, that's, that's just the big win for us.